Hey, MTS crew. Hey, what's going on, y'all? I hope everything is all good in the neighborhood. Yes, we have a little treat for you that I want. To, I'm challenging the kids to try for Christmas. I made this dessert, I think, around Father's Day last year. If mm -hmm. you want to go and look at my other videos. But we're putting a Christmas twist on there so the kids can make a dessert that's delicious for Christmas. And it's very inexpensive. I think about yes. what twelve or thirteen dollars to make this dessert, mm -hmm. and so I wanted to share this dessert with the kids. Tell the kids to come around the camera, <laughs> come yes. around the video, yes. so I can show y'all how to surprise your parents. Okay, y'all, we're gonna pray for us. Okay, Father God, in the name of Jesus, God, we thank you, we praise you, we worship you, God. We thank you for our life, our health, and our strength, God. We thank you for our MTS crew, God. We thank you that you are putting a hedge of protection around them and their families yes. that no hurt, harm, and danger will come to them. Yes. In the mighty, mighty name of Jesus, the name above all yes. names. Amen. He's in the miracle working business, y'all. Oh, yes. I'm going to yes. do some testimonies so y'all can hear yes. about the miracles that God has done for me and for me. Sister Pat. Yes. Yes. So we're going to hurry up and get into this, y'all. Yes. And I'm going to tell you everything you're going to need. You're going to need some ice cream sandwiches. Let me see. We got about two boxes, but we, we probably, let me see. We mm -hmm. probably won't need these two boxes, but I like to get two boxes just in case. This is what you're going to need. Heath bar. You can use, we had to chop this one up, but you can buy the little um, nougats mm -hmm. that's already chopped up. Two cool whips. But to put a Christmas twist on this, we already pre-colored the cool the cool whip. We have red and we have green. Now, if you want to get the desired red that you want, you would probably need to use about two of those little bottles of um, food color, but that's okay if it look pink. We know it's red. Okay. You're going to need some peppermint, crushed peppermint. And if you don't have the crushed peppermints, just get a couple of peppermint sticks, grab them off the tree, put them in a bag, hit them a couple of times, and you have your crushed peppermint. You're going to need, I think this is about a 9 by 9 or 10 by 10 pan, mm -hmm. but you can put, make sure that you put this dessert in something that can freeze well. You cannot freeze glass. I don't, you know, I don't know whether you can freeze glass, you know, maybe they have a special type of, type of glass pan that you can use, but I wouldn't take a chance if you don't know whether that can be. Some things come from the stove, from the refrigerator to the stove, and you can freeze, but we're just going to use this, and uh, this dessert is best frozen. 24 hours, but you know we don't let it stand there for a few hours to cut a piece just to show you how it looks Yeah, <laughs> so we're gonna put it in there for a couple of hours, but let's get started you Ready yes. sister Pam? Yes. I'm ready. I'm ready. Look, we always ready. Yeah, we sitting on ready <laughs> <laughs> Okay, y'all These are ice cream sandwiches and how many is in a box? Twelve. I think it, twelve. it's 12 in a box So we have about a box and a half here so what we're going to do, we're going to take our pan and we're going to start to line the ice cream sandwiches neatly in the pan and make sure your ice cream sandwiches stay frozen until you're ready to, you know, work with them. But what I would do if I were you. I would just go ahead and take these out of the wrapper because they are pre-wrapped and then put them in on a tray and just put them back in the refrigerator. Don't let them, the freezer, don't let them sit down. Okay, sis, may I have a knife? Okay, you see this little opening here? What we're going to do is to cut cut one in half like so. And just cut that one again. And just sort of fill that in right there. Cut that one in a little bit. Now, our ice cream sandwiches are not perfectly frozen, but that's okay. And we're going to cut. We cut another one in half, and we're going to push that down in there just like so y'all it's like a puzzle 
okay? Now, we're going to start with our red. I know it looked pink, y'all, but it's, but it's red. We're going to start with our red Cool Whip. And this is a 8-ounce Cool Whip here. 8 ounces. And what I did, I just put the food coloring in there, and I just colored it in there. all this in here and we're going to spread it. Kids, y'all going to enjoy this. This is fun to do for Christmas Eve or anytime. Okay. They are so good, aren't they, sis? Mm -hmm. Me and Sister Pam got to stay away from all this stuff. <laughs> oh, yeah. But this is just an easy, easy ice cream dessert for the kids. And for the young at heart, too, mm -hmm. huh? Yes, ma'am. have to be perfect y'all okay now we're going oh you know what I'm sorry y'all I'm sorry y'all I forgot to put the heat bar in there so after you get that first layer on I don't want to try to move these but after you get that first layer on, you just go ahead and start adding your um, heat bar. Okay. And that's like a toffee bar, so they're real good. Okay. Kind of press down. Sister's going to open up uh, some more. Like I say, y'all, make sure that your ice cream is frozen. So if you want to use some sort of peppermint ice cream, I mean peppermint candy, like the Andes candy, that's good in here also. Let's see. Put this. Yes. Let's see if we get this one. Okay, I got that one in there. Uh -uh, I need a, some more. We have more in there. Like that. And we're going to cut a piece to fit in this little jigsaw puzzle here. It's clear to fit down in there the best you can. The thing is, try not to leave any open spaces. Okay? Fill all of your open spaces. Let's see. Just squeeze it down in there. Yeah, just run it down. Let's put this opening up. Another one. Okay. Now let's see if we squeeze this down in there. There we go. We got it. We got it. Okay. So just press down a little. Did you cut a little piece yeah. <laughs> Okay. Yeah. This is how you want it to look, y'all. Okay, now we're going to go and we're going to use the green food color. Okay. That's good. 
So this is something that you all can do Christmas Eve. And it would be ready for dessert Christmas Day. Okay, what we're going to do is just spread this on top. This is something that the kids can do by themselves. No help. There's no baking, y'all. None. So. Okay, we got that spreaded on there. Oh, a little bit right here. And the ice cream sandwiches at Walmart was what? Uh, 254. $2 they went up a little bit, man. Okay. Okay. Now, what we're going to do, we're going to sprinkle our, pep our peppermint on here. Let's sprinkle it all on there. And if you have Heath Bar left, you also can sprinkle some Heath Bar. If you want to um, use chocolate to sprinkle on here, you can. But we're doing peppermint. And if the kids want to get creative and do any kind of Christmas decoration or writing um, with your piping bag, you're welcome to do that. But this is going to be delicious, y'all. I promise. Okay. We're going to put this in the freezer, uncovered, for a few hours. Then we cover it up because if you cover it, you don't want to disturb the um, the um, whipped cream nor the peppermint on here. So this, we're going to go ahead and stick this in the refrigerator and hopefully we'll be able to uh, show you the end results in a few hours. Okay. Okay, y'all, our Christmas this, uh, ice cream sandwich dessert is ready, yes. and we're going to try this. Now, I would advise that this stay in the freezer overnight. It's been in for a few hours, and uh, we're going to go ahead and try it so you can see it. This is it. Okay, let's cut it. Let's cut it, y'all. Okay. It froze pretty good, I think. Mm -hmm. But it's best overnight, don't you think, Seth? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm going to cut scissor piece. That's a big piece. That's okay. This is good. <laughs> she said that's a big piece. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Have to reach up under there. Let's cut a little more, y'all. Make sure it's good and cut under there. You have to reach under there to get it. So it's a cut. Hold on for a minute, y'all. I want to make sure we get this out right. Okay. Yeah, I know the first piece is always holding out of anything. Okay, it's coming, y'all. It's thick, so just make sure y'all cut it well because it is thick, thick. Okay. Be 
Did I got you? <laughs> it's like I got it. Okay. There it comes. Just push. Your piece fell over, sis. But that's, that's my piece. Here it is, y'all. Y'all, this is so easy for the kiddos to make. I mean, just super, super easy. This is how it looks on the inside. The red and green food coloring. And then you have your ice cream sandwiches. And you have your peppermint on top. And um, in the middle, you have the heat bars pieces in there. So, this is how it looks, y'all. Okay, so the pan, I don't know whether I'm going to be able to eat all this, but this is it. Let's try it. <laughs> Y'all, please let the kids go get those ice cream sandwiches at uh, Walmart. Very reasonable. Um, this dessert cost about, everything went up a little bit. So I would say it, it, everything, probably about $12 to $15. Yeah. And let the kids make this dessert for Christmas. It will give them something to yes. to do. You know, feel a part of the cooking and the festivities. Yeah, can do the kids. Yeah, and the festivities. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let's try something. Mm -hmm. And guess what? You can drizzle chocolate on there. You can drizzle whatever you want to drizzle on there. Mm. Y'all, we doing these desserts, but the first of the year, everything gonna change. Oh, yeah. mm. Mm. That's good. That's love good. it, love it, love it. My grandson is going to enjoy this. Mm -hmm. I love the peppermint. Mm -hmm. Good. Good. Show yours, sir. Mm -hmm. So remember, when you're cutting this, cut it deep. Because it was a little hard to get out. Mm -hmm. But this froze, I think, pretty good. It did. Mm. All I can say mm -hmm. is. All I can say is decorative. Good. Mm -hmm. Easy. I told y'all I'm all about easy. And when you finish um, serving, and if you have left anything left, go ahead and put it back in the freezer. And just, you know, when you get ready to serve it again, you know, just take and cut it, you know, frozen. And then you can, you know, it's not going to be that frozen, I don't think. And uh, then you're going to take it and let it sit out. A few minutes before, you know, you can really, really cut down into it. Mm -hmm. That's nice. Mm -hmm. Says so ask to something. He want to come to a bite. So this is going to be enough for. Christmas Day. I just want to take a couple of pieces out of here so you can see how it looks and see how the the layers are. You don't need that many ingredients. Two containers of food coloring. I mean two containers of whipped cream. One um one bottle of green food coloring, one bottle of red food coloring. Um peppermint pieces, heath bar pieces. And what else did we put in there? Oh, the, the ice cream sandwiches. Mm -hmm. That's all you need. Show the kids this video. Buy them what they need. And let them go for what they know. 
delicious. Y'all, be good to yourself. And if you be good to yourself, you have no other choice but to be good to others. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope your family have fun with that, with this dessert. Mm -hmm. Bring the little babies in and, and let them have fun. God bless y'all. God keep y'all. Pat yourself on the back and encourage yourself. Paul had to encourage himself, so we have to be encouraged. In each other. Mm -hmm. In each other. But you know what? I'm happy. Yes. I know everything is going on around us, but guess what? I'm happy yes. to be alive. Yes, amen. I'm happy. Amen. God bless y'all. God keep y'all. Yes. See y'all later. Finish my dessert. <laughs> mm -hmm.